mean, it don't matter to me, you live in next door, but some people around here, you know how they are, and everybody seems to be on edge right now. You know, one has to go to a new school with a bunch of black bastards and Hey, you don't know, use that kind of language in my house, boy. I seen your house, Daddy. Don't you remember? You live in Miss Godshaw's house now. You ain't nothing but a tenant. You and Maddie was little, they still had a sign on that laundry uptown. No colors, maids in uniform accepted. So it's okay. We bring in white folks' things to watch just not our own. I guess their customers didn't want their clothes mixed with colored people's clothes. So that's what that sign means at the laundry mat I go. What sign? You know, the ones over the washing machine. <laughs> Do not mix whites and colors. <laughs> <laughs> I hear this, this man on the other side of the pump, the insurance agent, I guess it was. Yes, ma'am, he says, we'll come tow your flooded car away, but you gotta get the car off the roof of the house yourself. <laughs> <laughs> says his mom would still be alive today if we'd have left the day before the storm. He's not wrong. What we done tonight, it ain't a dumb toy. Well, it sure feels a lot like that must be. And I can't go back to living that old way. Get up and go to work and come back home again to some empty house, don't even know I'm there. But me, I can't go on living this new way like we're doing you and me. 